Hello everybody, <clears throat> DK here from Dwarf King Headquarters and we are here doing a very special review. I got this in the mail a few days ago and plus I'm a big, I play this game a lot. So um, we're going to be doing a review of this bad boy right here. I'm going to have to move you up a little. Can you see it? It's a Star Wars X-Wing Miniatures game um, starter kit. I got this off of Amazon from my friend who I got it a few days ago. And if it's zoomed up, then that means you guys will be in for a treat. So it does come with three fighters, apparently. Comes with two TIE fighters that I know are from the ver the first, um, what is it, the first, it's not the first Empire, it's the first Legion? I think first something, I don't know. It's first something. And then you get, of course, Poe Dammer in here, which is going to be really fun. Okie dokie. Well, I'm going to have to hold you up for this. Look at what's in it. That's really cool. You get the movable dice, you get all the things. You get pretty much all the little stuff that you need for a starter kit. Oh, excuse me. So, let's begin the review. I'm gonna do this, make sure not to cut myself because that would just be bad. And if you guys hear I'm a little hoarse right now, it's because I have a cold, but I decided even though I have a cold, I'm gonna do this for you guys to show you what is in this big thing. Sorry. Ugh. Okay. Okay, so let's begin the review. There you go, Star Wars. So it looks like we do have a couple things here to review. If I can just, excuse me, sir. Pardon me, sir. So we do get the fighters. Let's take a look at those. Um, this should be really interesting. This is a classic thing. But look at this little guy. Aw, he's so cute and fast and probably wants to hurt someone. But this is the new um, X-Wing fighters from Star Wars, um, The Force Awakens. Um, you guys should go see that movie. It's amazing. Oh, uh, let's see here. Who else do we got here? Whoa, hello. You're supposed to be there. And then we got two of the TIE Fighters. Of course, you can see, I believe it's from the first something. I can't remember the name of it, but, um, yeah, it's going to be really fun using these guys playing, um, against my friend. Um, there are those. There's something in here. Oh, yeah, there's the little setup pieces, the bigger setup pieces, which are nice. So this is an interesting thing. My friend did a review of, um... Uh, Star Wars thing, so it's his his thing is called um Geek Theory, I believe. Geek Thought, no, that's it, Geek Thought. Um, so be sure to check him out. But um, yeah, not too bad right here. We got different numbers, we got tokens, we got pieces, but there are more pieces on the back. Oh my, oh me, oh me, oh my, what do we have here? Um, well, there's a four piece. There's the I think that's a token. There's some asteroids. There's some shields. Okay. So, I like this. This is actually really cool. I love it. Um, this will be good for me to use on um, next Monday because I go there for campaign mode. That's talking about this. Fantasy Flight Games Forbidden Stars. Telling you all the different games it has to offer. Eh, not bad. Uh, let's see here. Then it talks about A-Wing Expansion Pack. Uh, Tiny Interceptor. Uh, let's see. Y-Wing and TIE Advanced, which honestly is pretty cool. Uh, let's see here. That is beautiful. Beautiful. There's the little maneuver. No, wait, that's the check the range. Let's move you out of the way, X-Wing piece. Let's get down to the good stuff. Or at least try to get down here. Welcome to another opening of DK Can't Figure Out How to Open This. So we got this thing here. Oh yeah, it's missions. Oh yeah, these are like for, um, this is a mission guide introduction, teaching you a lot of stuff. You know, some pretty cool things here. Um, let's see, there's the learn to fly paper, which I don't need. I don't need the rules experience or this, but I'll keep it just in case, you know, in case if I forget about some things. Then we got our trusty set of dice with um, little black thingies? I don't know, but we got some dice, so that's nice. And then we got the cards. Oh, me, oh, me, oh, my. My favorite thing. And a good thing, actually. So, let's see what we got here. So, of course, you do get Poe Dameron T-70 X-Wing. It's three attack, two, believe, agility. Uh, three hull and then three shield. <laughs> <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, 
When attacking or defending, if you have a focus token, you may change one of your that results to a crit, to a hit, or a evade result. And uh, excuse me, I haven't played this for a while. Um, so basically, he gets a focus, a target lock, and a boost. And also, those are pirates, pilot skills down there, which honestly, I need his crew. So very fun. Then we got blue ace T seven D Y ring when performing boost action. You may use that or that template. Hmm. Uh, so honestly, there's some pretty cool cards here. We got Red Squadron Veteran T70 X Wing. Um, you know, a little bit of an earlier model. No, a later model, I think. Uh, Blue Squadron Novus T70 X Wing. Um, you know, it's kind of like um, Omega Ace Tai Fo Fighter. Eh. That's funny. I'm hearing Fo all the time. In the case, when attacking, you may spend a focus token and target lock. And a target lock, you have another defender to change all your results to crit results. Jeez. That seems a little rough, don't you think? Uh, Epsilon Leader Typho Fighter at the start of the combat phase. Remove one stress token from each friendly ship at range one. Hmm, not bad. Uh, Zeta Ace, when performing a barrel roll, you may use that template or that template. So that's going to be fun. Um, Omega Squadron Pilot, um, basically it's got four things, 17, not bad. Uh, you know, just the good old-fashioned TIE Fighter Pilots. Let's go to the... I believe this is the damage deck, the new damage deck that has been in it. Yeah, so we do get some interesting little things here. We get the wired when attacking or defending. If you're stressed, you may reroll one more of those results. When you receive a green maneuver, you may perform a free barrel roll action. Um, before you reveal your maneuver, you may discard this card, ignore obstacles until the end of the round. Uh, Proton Torpedoes, this is a fun card. Spend your target lock and discard this card to perform this attack. You may change one of your focus results to a crit result. Um, weapons guidance when attacking, you may spend a focus token to change one of your blank results to a hit result. So this will be an interesting try build. Um, then of course you get the damage deck, like blinded pilot, stun console, weapon failure, malfunction, direct hits, you know, stuff like that. But um, if you guys enjoyed this review and you want to see more reviews later in the future, Subscribe for more, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.